Kuwait Diabetes Society, or the KDES, in collaboration with the Departments of Education and Training, Clinical Services, Nutrition and Public Relations at Dasman Diabetes Institute, held the first Future Camp for Children with Diabetes, entitled Towards a Better Tomorrow. During the three-day camp, children engaged in multiple activities like swimming, basketball, training, bowling and a visit to the scientific centre. Sarah Glove has more in this report. Kuwait Diabetes Society, in collaboration with Desman Diabetes Institute, held a ceremony to mark the conclusion of the first ever diabetes camp for children in Kuwait. The diabetes camp is uh, an idea that's been executed in several countries before and it's one of the um, um, activities that we perform under the IDF. Um, the idea of the camp is to have the kids with diabetes living together, living with uh, their um, staff, uh, medical staff, the educators and the dietitian, and to be taken to the normal activities of life together with the entertainment activity and exercise. So during the camp we took them into several activities including physical activities and those include basketballs, uh, uh, sessions and swimming sessions. Um, during that session we taught them how to take care of exercise, what to do, what precautions they should take and also how to check blood sugar and after the exercise they also um, saw the effect of exercise on their blood sugar and also we took them through other several entertainment activity. We took them to the IMAX, the scientific center, and during that time they um, had a lot of fun. Uh, they were bonding together, they supported each other, they make new friendship, and they, they, they got the idea that they're not alone in the community, and there are a lot of uh, kids with diabetes that are living normal life. Well, this event is the first uh, diabetes camp for kids in Kuwait and uh, a camp uh, is designed really to bring children with diabetes together uh, to learn skills in self-management and also to uh, have fun and uh, it's, a, it's a journey, it's an adventure mainly and uh, to, to uh, know the benefits of physical activity on their blood sugar and uh, also it's uh, to take them away from their families and so they can be independent. 22 boys aged 11 to 14 years and affected by type 1 diabetes participated in a full three days camp accompanied by a team of pediatric endocrinologists, certified diabetes educators, nutritionists and nurses, as well as volunteers from the Blue Circle campaign under the IDF's Young Leaders program. Uh, some of the kids are on insulin injections, some of them are on insulin pumps. So we've managed for the medical part. Uh, we were with them the the whole 48 hours during camp on call, uh, manage their exercise activities, manage their food intake, carb counting, and um, if there is any uh, medical emergencies, which uh, not, not, nothing happened so far, uh, we were able to manage it with our uh, special uh, expertise and medical equipments. Diabetes camps provide a safe haven and offer a rich experience for children with diabetes to develop their self-management skills, independence, group bonding and team building in an atmosphere of adventure and fun. Tasman Diabetes Institute is renowned in the state of Kuwait for organizing various events that aim to raise awareness in a fun and light-hearted way on the issues related to diabetes. And this time they have brought the first ever future camp for children with diabetes in collaboration with Kuwait Diabetes Society. From the Regency Hotel, this is Sarah Glib reporting for English News.